Back in Australia, I'm gonna be dreaming about this every single night and I'll be crying. I'm gonna be crying, guys. Yo, what's up, guys? Morning. Today, we're gonna go on a hawker food adventure and we're gonna eat until my belly turns to two. Yes, we're gonna go to the Maxwell Food Hawker Center and we're gonna try out everything there. All right, let's go, guys. Yeah. Looking rich. <laughs> nice butt, girl. Hey. Looking really good. Thank you. I like the white top. I got casual, simple today. Yep. White top, denim skirt, and I got my Nikes. Oh. Which I got for my birthday from Toy and Lubin. Nice. <laughs> Your hair looks really nice too. Oh, thank you. I really like the lipstick. Does the color look nice? I'm getting used to the color now. Okay. Yeah, so it's pretty good. Yeah, it looks good like during the day um, when you do like your face and stuff, but at night time when you're like tired and you know, bare face, you look like... Uh... I look like a grandma. <laughs> a legit grandma. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, let's go. <laughs> it's on the 12th floor, there is a gym. Let's check it out. Um, I really like this gym because it's got this twerking machine over here that you gotta suss this out. If you want the sexy booty, guys, if you want the sexy booty, this is the way. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. And then out here, you've got the pool and a really nice view of Singapore. Wow. Check out this nice little pool. Yay. Wow. Cool. It's a swimming pool. No, it's not a swimming pool. <laughs> is, that, is that a giant mochi? I've always wanted... Oh, it's a seat. Damn it. Ooh. I'm getting extremely sweaty. I've only walked for a minute, but that's Singapore for you. It's not that oh. bad. It's actually not that bad. Singapore is lovely. I love the people here. They're so I love nice. Singapore. Everyone is so kind. They're so friendly. Everyone's out there just to help you. Yes, everyone. That's what I love. Help. They want to make sure that you're having a good time in Singapore. We had a taxi driver who was really nice to us. Yeah, yeah. Recommending us all these good places to eat at. And the food's amazing, and people yeah. speak English too. Yes, you like know, no language barrier here, so. Very good. Let's go eat. So first, we're gonna have some breakfast at Toast Box because oh, I want to oh. try their Kaya toast, which is a popular snack in Singapore. You are Let's obsessed go. with this place, aren't you? Every time she goes to an Asian country, she wants to get some toast. Let's check it out though. All right, so our breakfast is here. Yes, so we've Looks got so good. the peanut butter toast, Ooh. just on white bread. Yep. Then we've got a slice of pandan chiffon cake. That looks really good. My favorite. One of my favorite cakes. And what's this one over here? So this is a popular traditional what, Singaporean what snack. It's a kaya toast, which is a sweet coconut based jam. We've got my milk tea. And I absolutely love milk tea. And this one's got like a little some syrup at the bottom. I don't know what it is, but it looks delicious. All right, let's eat. First bite. I've never tried anything like this. And a lot of Singaporeans recommend this oh, yeah. toast to us. So we want to try it out. Ooh, how's it? What's it oh taste my like? God, it's so good. <laughs> no, oh it's, God, it's actually really good. Is it like a jam? It looks yeah. like an apricot jam or something. What is it? Oh, and the butter is really good as well. Mm. That's delicious. You have to be careful when you eat with your lipstick, right? What's to show them how to do it? If you don't want to ruin your lipstick, you know, yep. make sure it doesn't touch your lips. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Lipstick. Success. I really okay, let's like see it. Oh, wow, what's it taste like that? It's just butter and jam, but a really nice jam. Okay, you know what? Let me try it out. Mmm. I love that paste. I would love to have it in a jar and take it home. It's so delicious. Okay, the peanut butter toast. You can't My go favorite. wrong with peanut butter. Can peanut we? butter. And I love how they like cut it into cubes for you already, so you can just pop it in your mouth. Good. Is it a 
It looks like crunchy peanut butter. Tasty, is that? It's just like peanut butter okay. bread, yeah. yeah. I feel like yeah. this one's better. It's yeah. really good, yeah. Okay, let me try this. The pandan cake. Look how fluffy this cake is. I love it so much, so airy. Back at home, I always get pandan cake, so I'm very excited to try one in Singapore. All right, let's go. Oh. Mm. Really? Oh, really good, yeah. This has got some really nice flavors in there. It's like really light, fluffy, and like, I don't know, it's got a hint of something that's just beautiful. You're like sweating. I, I'm oh, always sweating. And it's gonna be sweat central, guys. Everywhere we eat in Singapore, dripping. I need like a headband. And last is my milk tea. Let's try it out. I think I'm supposed to mix that. <laughs> It's so sweet at the bottom. Yep, mix it, mix it, mix it. I just drank all that black syrup. By the way. It's gone. It's gone. I, drank, I just had a sugar shot, pretty much. Oh, goodness. And that was Toast Box. Okay, guys. Very, very satisfied. If yeah. you haven't tried Kaya Toast before, I highly recommend it. I honestly didn't think toast could taste that good. <laughs> but I would definitely eat that again. It was many, good. many times. It, it was, was really very good. good. All up, less and than $10. Fast. Great stuff. Good breakfast area. On to lunch. So we're on Orchard Road right now. Just gonna do a little bit of shopping, exploring, because we wanna get a little bit more hungry before yes. we hit the Hawker market. Orchard Road is huge, so there's a lot to do. Mm. You'll buy a lot of souvenirs, designer brands if you're into designer yeah. clothing yeah. or bags and stuff like that. You gotta have the money, man. Yeah. You gotta have the money. But it's very pretty to just have a look and just walk along the road. Mm -hmm. All right, let's explore. You gotta be careful when you're in Orchard because it is so busy. There are so many stores in Orchard Road. I always get lost here, so make sure you know where you're going. For example, we just wanted to cross the road and now we don't know where we are. We're, We're lost. in We're Ion in... Orchard. We could be anywhere. Uh, oh man. Damn Cartier, got your own Ferris wheel in Singapore. What? What's hey. up, man? How Hi, you nice doing? to meet you. Here's an example of all the high-end stuff. This is just a strip of designer stores. And look, they've got Christmas decorations. Delena loves Christmas. One of her favorite seasons. My Santa. favorite holiday is Christmas. Ah. To be honest, I never celebrated Christmas. Ever since I met her, we've been throwing Christmas parties every year. It's fun. It's not bad. Ooh, swaggy. Yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh my God. Where are you guys from? Uh, we live in Singapore, but we're, I'm from Sweden. Oh, cool, dude. All right, a good example of us getting lost for real. We're trying to get to, you know, across the road over there. We went inside here, and then we went underground, and we, we came out here again. So, uh. There's Ariel again. <laughs> we're just going in circles. It's too hot for this, it's Singapore. So hot. It's too hot. You guys are mounting one of the spring moon. Oh, hey. Hi. Gotta visit the babe store every time. Let's go. Oh, let's go. I got the green mouth mask. You know I love the mouth mask guys, so this one's gonna be cool as hell. <laughs> we are 313 Somerset and a whole bunch of shopping in here. Let's see what we are. Oh no. No. Forever 21. How do Singaporeans even wear like woolly stuff like this? It is so hot outside. It's so nice. Yeah? Does it feel like a sheep? Oh no, shit. My bad. Wait a second. This would look awesome on me. <laughs> oh. Actually, it looks pretty good. You look like a cute little sheep. Ooh, warm. What'd you get? A sunflower top. Oh, nice. Ooh, summery. Yeah, I love floral stuff. 
Can we just leave, please? I'm so over this. So we're at Irvin's Salted Egg. I have salted no idea what this is. Snacks. Okay, so yeah. this is really popular in Singapore, and every time we we're walking out the streets, we saw everyone carrying a big That's yellow true. Irvin Salted Those Egg. Those things snack. right there. That's the one. Everyone's got them. Yeah, so we saw everyone carry them. So we're like, we'll try it out for ourselves and yeah. see how it is. I've had salted egg chips. It tastes like, well, they, that doesn't smell the greatest, but it tastes I've never interesting. Tried. So I've never let's tried. get a few packets, bring back home, taste test back at the hotel as well. Yeah, we got some. So it was $16 for two packets. It's a little bit pricey, but. Very expensive. It's very popular, so we gotta get it. It is so hot. Guys, you see that little strand of hair on my forehead? That's how you know that I'm sweating balls. Oh my goodness, my thighs are rubbing against each other and causing a fire. All right guys, just a little review of the Irwin salted egg chips. Uh, this one is a salted egg fish skin. And as you can see, it's actual fish skin. It costs about $8 AUD and Singaporean. Let's check it out. Let's open it up. All right, here it is, guys. So inside, it looks like <laughs> it's a whole bunch of fried fish. Okay, I'm going to grab one. I'll grab this big one. Holy moly! There you go. So it's just fish skin, deep fried and covered in flavoring, which is the egg part. Try time. It's so big. Mmm. So crispy. Listen, listen to the ASMR. All right, ready, guys? So good. Listen, I really like fish. It's pretty much just like if you put oil in a wok and you chuck the fish in and you get that crispy, delicious golden crust. They just took that off, they sliced it off, deep fried it again and chucked egg flavors on it. That is really good. Worth the $8, definitely. So good. Such an Asian chip though. <laughs> so one thing about these chips are... <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> that my breath smells like stanky fish Oh my eggs. God. It's eggs, no. fish, it's and so crust. It's so strong. It actually smells like fish. It's yeah. so strong. Stop breathing. So, um, go away. That's what happens when you kiss me. Give me a kiss. Oh, go away. <laughs> Guys, this is how you know if the hotel is good. They restock the damn slippers. So what I do is I always take two, put in my luggage bag, and hope they bring back more, and they did. Hey guys, so we're finally at the Maxwell Hawker Center, ready to eat our proper meal. Disregard yesterday, you know, the last one. So we found out on weekends, not all the stores are open, but it's okay, because it's not gonna stop us from eating. Yeah. We'll just check out the ones that are open, but just a tip for people who are traveling here to not go to Hawker Centers on the weekend. Okay, let's yes, eat. Yes, let's go. All right, guys, I need my Heinie's chicken. It is one of my favorite dishes. It's just chicken, a bit of soy, and rice. So simple, but so delicious. And this place is well known to have the Michelin star. Yeah, so the popular oh. Heinie's chicken on rice is called Tan Tan Heinie's chicken. We're actually looking for it right now, but we don't know if it's open or yeah, closed. Everything is. It's about 50% open. Thank the lords, it is open. Yes, Thank guys, you, it is open. food gods. Pretty much the only store we need to try yeah. it out. Because we haven't tried it before. We want to try it out to see what it's all about. Is it worth the hype? This is the next store we're eating at. Uh, I'm going to just get some dark again and hope for the best. Looks pretty good. Wow, it's beautiful. Wow, yes. Look at that. We're in the kitchen right now. And it's incredible. Oh, the music! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> okay, the dark. Yeah. Straight from the oven. Ooh! That's steam. Yeah. Hey! Amazing. Amazing. <laughs> I, I, Sorry, what's your name? I'm Mr. White. Mr. White. Mr. Black. Ah, <laughs> Mr. Black, Mr. Yeah, White. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect, yeah. perfect. Okay, I, I want to give you one please for you. I like oh. longer napkin for oh, you. Oh yeah. 
You try. Oh, okay, okay, okay. This is the one you have. Yeah. Okay, it's fresh. <laughs> Straight from Mr. White himself. Yeah. Yeah. Let's try. Just pick it up. Yes. Thank you. Oh, it's hot. Oh, it's Mm. Mm. Number one. Number one. Oh, yummy, Number one. Yummy. Thank you. <laughs> wow, that was an amazing experience. I the don't Singaporean even know what happened. people. <laughs> They're so nice. So basically, he brought me in the kitchen. Yeah. He gave me a, a sample of the duck straight from the oven. Really? So it was so juicy. It was so delicious. Oh, you're so lucky. And they didn't even let me pay yet. They're like, you know what? Enjoy your food and then pay afterwards. Really? So yeah. Wow. We're very excited. We've got the Chinese chicken rice. Here we've got a pork and crispy pork on wow, noodles that looks good. and duck on rice. You guys are making so much noise. <laughs> Everyone in the hawker center was just looking at oh, that really? store. Oh, really? And I was like, what oh. is going on? <laughs> and as always, I've got my delicious drink, sugar cane. And another funny thing about the stall is they play Wong Fei Hung. That kung fu song really? on repeat, I'm and that's so why they're so pumped. To try this. All right, let's go, babe. Go straight for that duck. So it is, is glistening. It yep, that's it. And they've also taken out all the bones for us. They're so kind. Oh, that looks so good. It's good, right? So juicy. Okay, this is what I have been waiting for. This juicy chicken. That's it. That's it. And I've got to, I've got to have a bit of rice. This soy sauce rice looks so good. Let's try it. Mm, so delicious. And for $5, what a steal. Absolutely. I love this place. Maxwell Hawk Center is already blowing my mind. And also this piece of pork just looks so good. When they drizzled it with that special sauce, I could not stop drooling. Let's try it. Oh. Mm. So good. Let's try the crispy pork. Mm, it's dripping with oil. Mm. I love Singapore. This is better than any rice dish I've had back at home. It's just on a whole nother level. I can't get over how sweet and succulent this piece of pork is. It is incredible. This is what I'm going to dream about when I go home. Back in Australia, I'm going to be dreaming about this every single night and I'll be crying. I'm going to be crying. This is what we love about cheap eats. It's delicious. And this is why we came to Singapore to eat food like this. I mean, everything is so cheap. You get a lot. The serving size is really good, mm. affordable. And you can just try everything else here. You won't get full on one dish. So, yes. Let's eat. Let's go. Dig in, guys. That was some true Singaporean dining experience. So cheap, so amazing. The ambience, the environment, the people. I mean, the owner was so amazing. And just eating, sweating, and just taking in all the flavors and everything is just the best experience. A really good reason why you should come to Singapore. That was so delicious. It was $7 for those two, the noodle and the rice, duck and pork dish. $7. Dollars. Would love to visit it when um, everything is open, but highly recommend. Ah, oh, stuffed. So cool. So good. We spent no more than $20 and yeah. we ate a whole bunch of food. And everything it's the was best. so satisfying, so delicious. I don't want to eat more because the last two dishes that we had was yeah. so good. They're incredible. Yeah. You don't want to like ruin your appetite with uh, anything else. Make sure you guys check out the Maxwell, Maxwell Hawker, Hawker Center. Center. We are going to explore a bit more yes. and then continue eating. Thank you. Oh. Welcome back to Delena's tourism videos. So across from the Maxwell Center, we have the Buddha Tooth Relic Temple. It was founded in 2002, but opened to the public in 2007. So it's quite new. As you can see, the exterior is very nice. It is new. very new. It yeah. looks amazing. It looks incredible. You can go inside, but you're not allowed to wear singlets or skirt or shorts. So oh. make sure to wear long sleeve clothes when you're checking Damn out the it, temple. Why do I wear a skirt today? So we are Chinatown right now and uh, they sell a whole bunch of souvenirs. You've got restaurants and a whole bunch of Chinese me's. As in people. I'm Chinese. I see my uncles and aunties here. Oh man, come here. Oh! 
God damn it. I'm sorry. How cool are these buildings? They look so cool. So Chinesey, man. Very excited to go to Hong Kong. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Get it. Get it, Grimers. So we're gonna get dessert now, and Orchard Road is known for their ice cream sandwich, which we're gonna try. They have many flavors that you can choose from. They've got a new flavor, which is green tea. They've got durian, chocolate, red beans, sweet corn. Which one are you gonna get? I'm gonna try durian. Ooh. Cutting it like a loaf of bread. Like a stick of butter. Thank you. Thank you very much. Give a change. Thank you. So we got the ripple flavour instead because I forgot that John can't eat durians. So we decided <laughs> to share one. Okay. Is it too stinky for me? So you've got the sandwich. You got a rainbow sandwich bread. Yeah. And ice cream. Ripple, I think it's just vanilla ice cream with a bit of raspberry inside. How's the taste? Mm. Yum. Yum, the ice cream's so good. Oh! Mmm! So good! <laughs> Come on, let's go in. Oh. Oh. Uh, oh, <laughs> oh my goodness, guys, it's raining. And it's so humid, my screen's fogging up. Oh no. <laughs> Rain and humidity. Wow. Ah. Oh, you alright? Ah, uh, nearly slipped and died. <laughs> it's a sign. It's a sign. 